Fairchild Air Force Base seeks to become the center of excellence for air refueling, and I am confident that nobody does our particular mission better than our teammates make it happen. We have all kinds of support agreements, and what makes us unique in all of that is these are really, really robust opportunities for us to partnership with. Really neat to see the amount of people that stand up in our chamber that support Fairchild Air Force Base. I think it's very important for us to take every opportunity to uh, collaborate and build our futures together. Uh, I don't think our cultures, uh, at least the inter interdependence of our cultures, as well as our plans for success can never be underestimated. Colonel Ryan Samuelson, the base commander and 92nd Air Refueling Wing Commander out of Fairchild Air Force Base. I hope what we are is I hope we're incredible partners because if it wasn't for this community, we wouldn't be here. It was this community who stood up nearly over 75 years ago and put this base on the map. And I hope that we are extremely good community partners. We look out there to partner in any possible way we can. When I think about the way that we've engaged and impacted the community the most, I'm proud to say that uh, you know, flying the flag of freedom and making sure that that fuel is delivered out there for our community is, I think, uh, the number one way Fairchild Air Force Base makes it happen. It's a never-ending quest uh, for improvement that, that keeps all of us involved. Uh, I'm grateful that we have a relationship, but I'm most thankful, most thankful for the earnest efforts of uh, individuals and groups who are constantly seeking new ways to serve and lead in this community. And so we build that pride in accomplishing the mission, just as those members of the Inland uh, Northwest do as well. For local community to recognize Fairchild Air Force Base as part of their identity, that's pretty humbling.